Welcome to Trophy TV, it is the Everton News Daily. Greta Steinson's position at Everton is reportedly under threat uh, this following Marcel Brands' leaving of the club earlier in the week. Uh, the Everton board or hierarchy are reportedly torn as to what to do with Marcel Brands as number two. Steinson, the former Bolton defender, was in place at Everton, is still there for now. Um, and it's thought it's thought that some people at, in the club want to keep him for continuity, while others think it's best to make a clean break with that regime and start with something different. So um, the Athletic report on this, it's really interesting to see what Everton will actually do, whether Steinson will stay or whether Everton will appoint like a technical director as opposed to a new director of football. I guess we're going to find out over the next few weeks, but just right now he's still there, but it does seem as though the club are considering whether to let him go as well following Brands' exit from the club earlier in the week. Uh, Jao Virginia made his third appearance of sport in Lisbon last night. The Portuguese goalkeeper is on loan at Sporting for the season uh, with a view to a permanent deal. That is, if he impresses. He played in the Champions League against Ajax. Uh, Ajax won the game by four goals to two and Sporting manager Ruben Amarin admitted afterwards that a decision would need to be made at the end of the season. He said, we need to see Virginia in more games like this uh, to be able to make an informed decision. It is reported that there is a fee of £3 million being agreed between Everton and Sporting for the young goalkeeper should they decide to keep him. Uh, I guess he just needs more games, but obviously he's got Adnan, who is uh, an excellent goalkeeper ahead of him. But we'll see what happens with him. Play more games, impress, and then he might get his move to Sporting at the end of the season. Uh, Everton today again linked with a move for Juventus midfielder Aaron Ramsey. Uh, Calcio Mercato reporting that Everton are in first place for the 30-year-old Welsh midfielder. He's been linked with Everton on a number of occasions, even when Carlo Ancelotti was here. He was constantly linked. Uh, his wages, he's on 300 grand a week. I don't think he'd be getting anywhere near that to come to Everton, if indeed Everton are interested in him. Newcastle have also been credited with a interest in him as well. So there you go. Uh, and Everton has uh, been Everton Hull has been chosen as BBC's live game um, on Saturday the 8th of January. The game will now kick off at 5.30. I wonder why BBC have chosen that one. They obviously feel there's an opportunity of a giant kill and it's going to be up to Everton to make sure that that is not the case. So Hull City versus Everton FA Cup third round tie will now be shown live on BBC One and it kicks off at 5.30pm. There you go. Uh, that's it for us. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't. Don't forget to play Ultimate Fan. It is free to play. The link is in the description. And if you want more videos, including daily live videos, join us over on Patreon. See you later.